In terms of managing emergencies, we need an asset officers. And the current we have only two asset officers who cannot work effectively from Monday to Monday, day, evening, night. So it becomes a big challenge to use only two staffs to cover the hospital effectively. We have not uh, received the money from July, for the month of July last year up to December last year. And we have added now six months. We are finishing the month of June today. That means a whole year, almost a whole year of not getting this facilitation. So in as far as the Arab Youth Program is concerned, uh, we have um, earmarked uh, almost a billion shillings for the entire Mutandaja in a financial year. Uh, I may not have the facts now, but I can provide when uh, as when we need it. Lower level facilities uh, receive about about 10 million, eight, between 8 and 10 million Uganda shillings. I'm the most impressed uh, person in regard to the RBF program in Butaleja and Usolo in particular, uh, that it has helped us to save lives of uh, many newly born children and the, the unborn plus the uh, pregnant mothers. It has really brought life to each and everything in terms of service delivery and uh, as we speak now, it is very hard to impress uh, the locals, but they are also able to give testimonies on how uh, service delivery has really improved within our Busole uh, Hospital. Uh,